Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to show you how to draw a pearl in 6 simple steps. This is a very simple drawing if you know how to lay a colored pencil properly. If you are an absolute beginner in drawing with colored pencils, I strongly recommend you to check out my other video explaining how to layer and blend colored pencils. I will put the link in the video description. So, if you know the basics of drawing with colored pencils, you can straight away proceed to the tutorial and if you don't, watch the blending tutorial first and come back here. This is going to be a simple tutorial with only 6 steps which are very easy to understand. Once you do everything properly, you will end up with a 3D looking pearl drawing which you can impress your friends with. Step 1. Outline All you need as an outline here is a perfect circle. You can use any household items to sketch a perfect circle. Here I am using a bottle lid. This is all you need to start the drawing. Step 2. Base color. This step is also very simple. You just have to fill in the circle with a base color. Here I am using the color cream from Prismacolor. In fact, I will be using Prismacolor pencil for most of this tutorial except the shadow part. I am using polychromous pencils for shadow because they tend to layer more uniformly and that helps to get a much more realistic shadow. So here I am just filling up the circle with a cream colored pencil. Notice how I use a very light hand so that only a thin layer of color is applied. Don't use too much force at this stage because you need to add a few more colors on top of this layer. So, once the base layer is complete, we can proceed to the next step. Step 3. Reflections Pearl has some reflective property to it, so they tend to reflect the surrounding objects in a very diffuse manner. The key here is to draw the reflections in a fuzzy manner. Never draw the reflections in detail because the pearl is not as reflective as a mirror for example. Here I am just using a few shades of French grey to add those reflections. Notice how the reflections are following the contour of the pearl. And the edges of those reflections are very fuzzy. Just add these in a layer by layer manner. You can also see that I am avoiding some areas so that I can add highlights later. You can use a reference image to easily know how the reflections behave and how to draw them. Once you have drawn the reflections in grayscale, you can add some color to it in the next step. Step 4. Adding Colors Pearls have a particular shine to them in various colors. 
mostly they consist of pink yellow and blue sheen so i'm using a pink a dull yellow and a blue pencil to add those colors you only need a hint of those colors so just use a very light hand and layer the colors very slowly even though this layer is very subtle the impact is very high because adding these colors make the pearl look much more realistic i have used the pink towards one side and blue towards the other you can even try other colors like purple green etc but make sure to use a very thin layer of color only step 5 adding highlights once you have completed the above steps you can proceed to add the highlights this is a fairly simple step but the impact is huge use a white pencil to slowly add the highlights in a layer by layer manner notice that i blend the highlights softly towards the surrounding colors we don't want any harsh edges anywhere in the drawing because the pearl is only partially reflective just like skin for example where we never use a sharp highlight So once the highlights are added the drawing is almost complete but for the final boost we need to add the shadows that way you can make it much more realistic Step 6 shadows For adding shadows I'm using a darker shade of warm gray and black pencil from Faber Castell Polychromos pencils because they tend to work much better for drawing shadows than Prismacolor Here I'm using a very light hand to draw layer by layer to get a uniform color coverage. I mostly use a crisscross pattern while drawing because it is much easier for me. Just follow the layering method I mentioned in my colored pencil blending tutorial to draw the shadow. Take a lot of time and draw the shadow with patience. I think I spent about 1/3 of time for this entire drawing for just making this shadow.
So that completes the drawing. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos like this.